Hey there, it's Peter from Indigo River Tiny Homes. We're standing out here in front of Casablanca. It's our newest model. It's the 10 foot by 36 foot Rambler Deluxe. And it's got some pretty awesome features. We're gonna start out on the outside here with our bike shed on the rear of the house. Bike shed goes with the Deluxe package. So this is the space under that extra landing, the L-shaped landing. So it's got a four foot by four foot door and over four feet of clearance inside. So you have plenty of room to put bicycles. And this, this one is 10 feet wide by four feet deep. You got that water heater in here. You get plugs. I think you can see that plug. And then the light switches over here with another plug. Mm -hmm. So you can, you know, plug in a space heater if you are having extra cold temperatures or if you have a dust buster you can keep it out here plugged in lots of options and i'm showing the cat door while i'm talking about the <laughs> dust buster so tell us about that cat door yeah so the cat door goes into the uh bathroom area in the laundry alcove it's in the laundry alcove actually um and so the cat can come through here and keep your kitty litter in the bike shed out here so it doesn't stink up the house and normally this is closed off, but the homeowner wants to finish the some of the bathroom herself. So this part will be closed off once she gets her shower set up. Okay, let's go around to the other side. We've got, do we want to show the front shed? If you want, we haven't showed that in a while, I guess. It's, this is our standard shed that goes on the front just of well usually goes on the front sometimes there's some rearranging happening and we put it down low just like me and you requested you know, <laughs> put the, the handle you mean yeah so the outside unit for the mini split usually goes down here underneath and i guess we didn't plan this part <laughs> This, this one's 10 foot wide, so it's an extra big storage shed compared to our eight and a half foot wide. I don't know, do you have the right key? There's so many keys on that. Sorry, y'all. Huge storage in here. Big truck going by. You gotta wait for that truck to go back. <laughs> so we do shelves on either side. This is like the angled section, and then a big tall spot in the middle for your ladder or your kayak. Yeah, over eight feet of ceiling height in there. It's two feet deep. Ten feet wide at the at the widest point. Okay, so we got our food truck window with a pop-up bar. Peter's going to demo. Food truck window pops open. The kitchen's on the other side. Pop-up dining bar. There's going to be a deck out here. Once she gets it in place, she's going to build a deck. So you can sit at the bar and have food passed to you. Pretty neat. That folds back down like that. Simple. So easy. We got the French doors here in this one with the blinds between the glass. So we'll start with the kitchen. All right. This is a beautiful custom kitchen with quartz countertops and open shelves above the, above the countertop, the apron front sink. And we got these. We did an extra wide cabinet here and it's got these neat little drawers right next to the sink. Your whatever you want, little extra utensils. Got the corner cabinet. Scrubby cabinets things. With the lazy seasons. Got a two burner cooktop with a vent hood. Got a custom vent hood here. It's really neat. And then the fisher and pipe bowl. I'll show the inside. Dishwasher. Really pretty deep. And it is. It holds a lot. It's pretty neat. 
pretty amazing. <laughs> and then the retro fridge, built-in pantry, and the, the convection oven is actually going to be inside the pantry there. Ah. So she's got a convection oven instead of an installed oven. Right. And that's the freezer down below. Yeah, the bottom right? freezer on the home. This so, house has a back door too. I'm gonna come around here. Okay. So you can see all the another corner cabinet with the lazy susan. And this is the trash can. Or you could put two smaller ones if you wanted one recycle and one trash. So I'll show the back door. Blinds in the glass. Again for the back door. All right, and this living area is plenty big for a sleeper sofa if you wanted to. Yes. So, sofa. often our Rambler and Homesteader have the kitchen kind of where Peter's standing. But sometimes we put the kitchen down at the end and the living area in the middle. If you want, so. if you want a bigger kitchen, and she's going to use this area over here um, in this corner for her office space for home office space cool so there's the um cat door and the litter box is going to go out there we forgot right. to say that's where the litter box is going to go so it'll be easy to and she's so she's, it's a halfway finished bathroom she'll be putting in her vanity and the toilet's here and it's already installed there's an the, incinerator toilet that's the vent there and then i would imagine she'll probably put some cabinets above that or something I don't know mm -hmm. so the shower goes here nice window that opens in the shower space anything else about this bathroom built-in washer and dryer all-in-one vented yeah get the vented kind the, the non vented is takes yeah. forever Push push open. She wanted just a really clean look on the, the stairs here with no handles or anything. So we did push open on the cabinets and drawers on here. So, so I'll go up the we got our almost always a spot to put our shoes. So I'm gonna throw my shoes in there before I go up into the bedroom. And the stair lights. She's got so many windows. These, I love these corner windows. This is a huge landing. She had her wardrobe on the side over here, so this landing is extra big. Uh, my daughter said, Mommy can do yoga there. Yeah. <sighs> King size bed platform. You got that built in step. And this is really cool. So we did a built-in shelf there with a little light underneath. Plugs on top, plug mm -hmm. over there. We already took off the globes for the reading lights. And an operable skylight. Yep. Can you Wonder Woman in this space? I think you can. Yeah. Up in the stand-up loft. Mm -hmm. I'm six foot tall. You can spin all the way around. It's 6'4 clearance over here, and then a little bit less over here where I'm standing by the, by the wardrobe. Is that everything? I think so. What? The fan? Pretty nice fan. That's a nice fan. <laughs> I love this kitchen. The kitchen is it's a pretty awesome kitchen. Yeah. All right. Thanks for watching. We'd love to build a tiny house for you too. Give us a call. We love you.